I heard they checking for me, no one checking on me, so I had to go run up a check. I got the message on me, ain't no flexing on me, my attorney gon' call and collect. Blessings on blessings for me, my successes only made them envious, they got upset. I had to put all they egos in check. I want the money, the power, respect, and I heard you know so and so, you're not a threat, cause I really know so and so, they like my- We're here a thousand kilometers from home, and it's time to go racing. We're here in Panorama in Eastern BC for the first round of the Canadian National Enduro Series. The first Enduro in Canada in nearly two years. It is gonna be a big three days. Now usually for a weekend like this, I'd pack up the beast, my dangerously dodgy 40 Conaline van and set up camp in the car park. But thanks to Outdoorsy, the supporters of this video series, I've been able to take it up a notch. I thought it would be funny to rent a full blown team bus just like the pros do. So behind us, we've got a 36 foot 2003 motorhome, and it is terrifying. Now it's only terrifying because I thought it would be a good idea to get acquainted with a 10 ton motorhome in downtown Vancouver. You're scared of no, stay clear. Hazards <laughs> are going on. <laughs> oh my ah! God. <laughs> We successfully navigated out, drove a thousand kilometers into the Canadian Rockies, and we're now set up in the parking lot, ready for the race weekend. It's got all the bells and whistles you could ever ask for for a race weekend. We're talking the bedroom, the bathroom, the bike room, the 4K high def TV, all really good stuff. So over the next three days, we've got a practice day today, the Friday. We've got a practice morning, followed by one race stage in the Panorama Bike Park. And then Sunday, we've got four massive stages which I think has a total climbing and descending of over 2,000 meters. So it's going to be a big weekend. I'm pumped. Let's get into it. <laughs> we are near the top of the first stage we're even going to look at on Friday morning. This is going to be savage on Sunday. It's like a <laughs> 14, 30 meter climb to start the day. <laughs> well, this is right up my alley. It's a real type three punisher right off the bat. Uh, <laughs> well, on Sunday, we're getting put up all the way from the bottom to the top. Uh, it's probably going to take three hours, I reckon. First climb of the day. Come on. Ain't nobody coming out, we're gunning from a hundred yards Trying to hit my mark, missing every time, this will be the start Of the picture perfect, watch it wish you work it with no hands I got plans, stack a hundred bands, people in the stands And they fans, singing every song, and they copping merch This will work, I emerge while you falling off from perch While you leaning, I'm even scheming to heat up like steaming demons I left for six years, they feeding, I came back to make How do you fit your bars through that? That was a left hand clip Oh, and he's blowing it! <laughs> Um, I think I read in the race book organizer that you're not allowed to cut the cord. <laughs> Second bread and cut the overhead, I'm all prepared now Feel like Freddy to your favorite rapper, yeah they scared now Kill them all inside my dreams except they really did now Head down Yeah that was cool and I was cool and I was cool I need you to go harder than that, come on It's savage, this stage is gonna just be about body and bike management and not many people have practiced it because it's such a mission to get up to so uh, it's gonna be some <laughs> suffering bodies and arms man there it is Woo! raining down the bottom what a track, man! Holy! Thing is, thing is, thing is. They want to put you in a box. In a box. They want to tell you who you can be. <laughs> what a day! <laughs> well, that's a successful end to our first practice day. We went all the way up to the top and then got to ride that 1300 meter trail down. That's going to be terrifying on Sunday morning. <laughs> it's so fast down the bottom. 
And midway through the afternoon that rain came through, which is muddy now, but it is gonna turn these trails into hero dirt. The forecast is for it to clear up like it is now. So we're in for two bloody awesome days. So tomorrow's agenda, a bit of practice in the morning, and then one race run right down the middle of the bike park in the afternoon. And then prep for the big day on Sunday. Uh, I think it's about time we set up HMC LS Fiona properly. I'm gonna test the shower out, see if I can wash the bike. And you put some potatoes on for tea. Tom, what are we doing? We're trying to set the palace up, but um, it's at least a two-man operation. How many, how many broken filmers and riders do you need to level a ship? The HM CLS Fiona is getting moored. It's pretty much already on it. Sick. <laughs> Tom, does it look straightforward? <laughs> There's a lot of words and diagrams on this page. <laughs> There's no trail notes. This should this is uh, the hardest stage of the day. <laughs> hey! I reckon we only need a little bit more of back right and we're sailing. <laughs> See what it did. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> you beauty! I'm terrified to sleep in there. <laughs> Uh, there will be new Chief Medical Health Officer orders in interior health. These restrictions include effective midnight tonight that masks will be mandatory. Outdoor personal gatherings will be limited to no more than 50 people. Plot twist. <laughs> I think if we've learned anything over the last 18 months is that plans sometimes are just a waste of time. So the event organizers are doing an amazing job. Late last night, they sent out a change to the event schedule so that they're within the approved health guidelines, which just changed yesterday. So what that means for us is we can pretty much throw everything we did yesterday out the window. I had a great time, but you can forget about that. <laughs> so what's gonna happen now, we're gonna do a three stage race and it's just gonna be in an afternoon or a morning session. That way they can break up all the races and keep everyone distance appropriately. So what that means for me, Sunday morning is my race day. We're gonna do three stages. And then that means today, well, I think we'll try to get into the bike park, ride a few trails, go talk to some people, see how they're feeling. So let's have another coffee and then let's go watch some racing today. Yeah! Looks spicy. What does what does Kim think? Uh, Kim would just nuke it flat. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, boy. Where do we go? No knee pads, no worries. Uh, go left is probably the best option. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Oh, that's me. Yeah. yeah. Oh, that's what we want. Get in. Get in. Get in. Yes, boy. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Yeah. We've successfully found our way to the gnarly section of moose powder, which is stage one. How good. <laughs> yeah! Yeah! Go in, go in! Yeah, boy! How's your eyes? Woo! Thundering! So we're just waiting for the first of the pro women to come down this final stage and just look at this. It's a real treat. Great work, you're so close. Yeah. What is not in? <laughs> It wasn't the Saturday we planned for, but everyone we met out there had a great time. Huge hats off to the organizers for dealing with that last minute change. Half the field have finished their race now, so they're all behind us there having a good time. We're all race ready, super serious for tomorrow morning. I'm a little sad we're not going into our Alpine adventure like we'd planned for on Sunday morning. Instead, 
I'm picking up my race plate at 7.45. We're doing three stages. I'll show you them properly tomorrow. I only managed to practice one of them yesterday because we weren't allowed on the course today. So two of them will be running pretty blind. The rig that's gonna get us through tomorrow, it's ready to go. We've got the downhill tire on the back and for those interested in the tire pressure chat, we're gonna start with a solid 25 PSI, fronts 22, and then there's a stage two behind us here. We'll go a bit lower. We'll get the tire pressure chat mid-race. I'm gonna try and run pretty light tomorrow. I think we're gonna be done in three hours. I've got everything I need mechanically on the bike, or at least I hope I do, touch wood. And I'll just carry snacks in my pockets. I'll take you through the snacks tomorrow. I guess I really haven't had a chance to think about how I'm feeling about racing. It's been chaotic, taking HM CLS Fiona here. Friday, we're up in the Alpine, just having our minds blown by how awesome it was up there. Today, curveball, just taking it as it is. So I guess it's time to put some potatoes on for dinner and we'll see you tomorrow morning. Up in the morning, uh, race morning. I feel like I've forgotten about 10,000 things. <laughs> we're on time for ProMean registration. Let's see what happens today. It's pretty tropical. Jacket's on now, probably take that off. We'll warm up on the pedal up to stage number one. Cool thing, we then come straight back down to here to the event village. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Nobody's harder than me, I'm a breaker of chains, I'm living it free Trust what I said and not what you see, nobody keep it in order like me Hey Tom, what's the energy like well, now? all these beauties, they've made it up to the top No nope. And what's the energy, fellas? Like, what are we talking? It's dangerously quiet Oh, it is, uh, <laughs> We're fired up Relaxed than most, most races <laughs> most, uh, I think numbers everyone's, here. everyone's just freaking stoked to be here oh, that, wow, This is yeah. a fun enduro, man Who, who's, seen, who's seen this course? Uh, this stage? Oh yeah Ah, sweet I think yeah. quite get the chance to practice it, so. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what is there on it? Right in this blind road? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Letterback. <laughs> it's that easy. Letterback. Letterback. <laughs> okay, so don't know what's coming. <laughs> and my 80% plan already out the window. Oh, man, that is really good. Okay, yeah, because of the schedule change. Ooh. 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 Woo! I can't do it like I normally can. There we go, the one trail of practice, <laughs> and it is so much drier than when we practiced it on Friday. Yeah! Tight and feet are hitting so many things.
<laughs> Stage two. The only similarity I'd say is what? That there's the same amount of mouth breathing. Uh, well, super dry, tight corners. Few were falling away, but holy, once it got steep in there, it was so fun. <laughs> um, didn't bin it, just a hoot and hollering, so that's a good sign. <laughs> Yeah. Just, just finishing off some sugar at the top of the last stage. The crew's having a great time. Sun's out. We've got a, <laughs> we've got a fresh built trail about to drop into. I haven't practiced it before. Max says slow as fast up the top half. Hit the ski run and then open it up. I don't just have a good time. <laughs> Jeez. Whoa, yep, sure. No idea where we're going down here. <laughs> Scary. Oh, here's next to ski run. Now they can win a buck. Smile on the face, put him in place, but at Gully on Cyber Space. Let's be frank, let's be frank. Running after him when you're the chase. You are the catch and he's the net. How quick we do, we also get to honor these one policies, my darling. You are the queen. Can't respect or heal neglect. You are the wind beneath his wings. You are the season, you are the reason. Fresh, fresh, dead. What a treat! Oh no! What a treat. That's the end of stage three, end of the race. Got the compulsory crash corner out of the way. Just laid it down once quickly. No biggie. Max was dead right. <laughs> Slow up the top, it's, it was so steep. And then just wide open through fresh loam. Too good. Let's go back and see what we did. <laughs> So just rolled into the finish, given the timing chip back. Got to look on the phone for the results, so one moment caller. <laughs> Wouldn't read about it. Third place. <laughs> oh, I'm stoked on that. <laughs> In the dirt, say it again, man, and that's a reverse. Uh, uh, Never rehearse, jump in it first. Call up the nurse, put the beat in the hearse. Uh, this is absurd. Say to preserve, don't get on the tracks, man, and they better swerve. Don't got a nerve, man, I never curse. Just casting these spells when I'm spelling these words. That's real, that's real, that's too that's real. Too real. I've been rose about, I need a new deal. New Trying deal. to figure out what I should do still. Do still. Really never waiting here too still. Too still. I don't even know what I should say. Well, what a weekend. I mean, we took the 69 plate to the pro podium. Dream result, if you ask me. But at the end of the day, it's just a result. And this weekend, like, really was more than that. Like, we explored a beautiful place with new friends, old friends, and had a great time doing it. And the first people to thank for that are Outdoorsy for making this video possible that we could share it with you. I mean, they allowed us to rent big Fiona Energy and take it to the campground here. <laughs> so if you want to take your own team bus to your next event, there's a coupon code in the description that'll give you a discount. The other people to thank are the event organizers for putting this on. The first enduro race in two years in Canada. I know I've seen a lot of event coverage at that pro level before, but it was so good that they put on a solid grassroots event. It was awesome to meet the under 14s, the U21s, right through the plus 50s who can offer some pretty good chat. <laughs> and that's also a perfect segue into the competitors, the supporters and the volunteers. Like, that's the things we're going to remember and the people we're going to see next time. So I think I'd better spend that prize money I got this afternoon on some cold beverages for them. Thanks for watching. Make sure you subscribe. We've got a few more events to cover soon.
show, she gon' want a picture, she 